This video was made possible by the EA Creators Network. The content visible is provided to me by EA. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, Neil Sims Play. And in this today's video, I will be giving you guys a walkthrough of the new balconies feature in The Sims Mobile. And so I will be showing you guys the new feature and how it, it works actually, because in The Sims Mobile, the the team has structured the balconies feature a bit a bit differently. So yeah, let me show you guys. But first, let's go through the tutorial, and here it is. This is a tutorial that was given to us by the team. So yeah. And it says, are uh, these balconies? Let's check them out. And then yeah. And then you click on the build by, obviously. <laughs> then on the build menu, mainly the build one. And then that says balconies, it's beside the rooms tab or the rooms option. It says I can place balconies from here. Yeah. Balconies behave much like rooms. You choose their position and stuff. There are also more than rooms. Let's switch to wall toggle mode now. Yeah, these are two different options. This is the one you can stretch the room according to the to your desired size. And the one next to it on the right side is the wall toggle option. This lets you change the wall types and there's there are gonna be arrows popping upwards as you can see on the in the video. And if you click on them you can change the wall type. So yeah. You can make it shorter or you can make it the normal wall height or you can remove the wall completely and just turn it into a platform basically and use it as a flat roof because yeah endless possibilities at this moment endless possibilities with the help of balconies now let's go through some railings that will be unlocked the, these three railings will be unlocked through the presets and then these uh, these other railings will be unlocked through bella's balcony quest these two railings and then there will be three more which will be unlocked through paid pack basically these three and yeah yeah that's it so guys let's move on to the balconies feature so here it is it's in the build section of the build by and it's right beside the rooms balconies so my first there are there are um six new variants or six variants of the balcony one the first one is holiday cabin balcony which is without the roof and the second one is holiday cabin but it's roofed it has a roof and the third one is fortress balcony basically without the roof and the same balcony with the roof and then bubblegum pop balcony without the roof and then the same balcony again with the with the without with the roof and yeah and just an fyi these these two balcony types with these railings they're gonna be unlocked um so basically if you buy this balcony then you're gonna unlock this railing type and same goes with this balcony so yeah and this will be in the game like the railing it will be in your game before as like a default balcony type railings but yeah um yeah let's see let's go up and see one well, they are without the roofs and with and without the roofs and they actually work <laughs> that's the main thing that needs to happen but let me remove them and show you the tips and tricks basically or the walkthrough or whatever we call it so yeah so first let me show you how to make different shapes of balcony yep you can even though this is like a um, just a same shape balcony 
So imagine you have a room that's like this and you want to make a wrap around um, porch, I guess we can see it like that and yeah. So first we go there and if you, oh sorry, that's the wrong one. And if you, you can choose if you want the one with the roof or without the roofs. So basically we can say I'll choose with the roof, I mean without the roof. And the main thing that you need to keep in mind is that the imagine if you're placing a balcony the balcony against a wall there should be a wall that should be toggled on so basically this is the toggle wall button and you can do it by one side as like like how it is done with the wallpaper or do it by the whole room thing but doing that only one imagine now this wall this wall is going to be touching this wall so this wall needs to be up because it will be going against another wall if you try to place it without a wall then it's not gonna be placed yep see it's gonna just show as red and can't be placed and it's gonna show up like the wall popping up or and you might think oh the wall needs to be popped up so why not place a railing against it that does not work as well you need a wall behind it so you go back in your wall toggles and then put it up and go back to your moving rooms or resizing room and then yep voila you can place it and there you go you can place the wall or the balcony not nothing glitched and like that and another thing to keep in mind is that the wall that you see, the balcony wall, you're gonna think that it's an exterior wall, but no, it's an interior wall because if you think about the game technically, in a technical way, the team has designed, used the room as like the base of the balcony, so then this still is like a room, but you can remove the walls and comes as an interior wall that's it so this is how you do it and now you might be like i want to create a wrapper on porch as i said you take this up balcony the first one that you place and then go into wall toggle and remove this side because obviously you want it to extend around and wrap around so get this one and to make sure because i think i did get this kind of bug like imagine if you're if you place the balcony and it touches the other balcony and goes red it sometimes breaks the, the balcony in a way and sometimes it doesn't place quite against oh it does okay that's nice nice to know i think they fix, fixed it but anywho you can do that and here you go and then do the same thing again but remove this side of the wall and that's it i must say that's just how you do it yeah and here you go it's just you did it one thing is that the problem is that once you're done or go off there will be a line because obviously there's meant to be a wall there and the game still thinks that there's a wall kind of there but your sim can actually walk or through so that's not a problem and the big thing is that there are animations on these railings nice the team did a really good job on this 3d animations but anywho and there are more ways to do this not more ways sorry and let me show you the things that are here this there are a lot of railings and i believe these railings are going to be in the paid Right? Not sorry, not the paid track. Sorry, this not this festival. Um, this will be paid, I believe. The, this and this and this will be paid. Whereas this, the this railing and this will be coming in the Bella's balcony quest, as I showed in the um, embargo video. And this railing, along with this 
will be unlockable through the balcony styles when you unlock when you buy these balconies so yeah, that's that and i just want to give you an fyi like imagine if you want to maybe i don't know if you build a bell not as a not balcony meant to say a room that's maybe like mm, let's say this big okay wait, let me just use an l shape it's gonna bug me out and maybe this big we see and you can be like oh my gosh there's a lot of things happening at this okay wait, wait. okay wait anyways it will be easier for me to show what's the problems and what is gonna be working but it'll be like oh no a lot of stuff is happening don't worry as i told you the same thing um imagine if this is touching here and you just decrease it but you'll be like oh i just want to extend it through imagine you like you just want to extend it through like like you get me they can't go through the wall anyways when i extend it through it does not because it's touching this wall so it's not going to extend through mm, what you can do is basically it's like building your own balcony in a way wait it's just too small area so like you can't do three by one it has to be four by one so you can't really build three by one space balconies okay so let's see so imagine that's the space and as i told you remove the walls that are not needed so this one and oh wait sorry we don't need this wall as well because yeah we need this wall and we will be extending it through see basically it's like legos you're just blocking through and then you do the same thing but this time you take out all the walls oh wait let me do another one trick so basically this is all extended right and let me extend this through oh no okay, no mind. let me do that and it's like okay let's just make one thing imagine you wanna since you can remove all of the walls you can do this trick too um just want to see if this bug actually still exists in the game because i don't oh nice it does it does actually oh that's great the bug is removed okay so basically i was talking about this one bug when we had our test builds there's to be this one bug like imagine if your balcony touched the, the wall like this and when you removed all of the walls i mean the walls that is not needed it still used to be like it used to tell us that it's an invalid space or something but luckily the team has fixed it and that's that so see that's how seamlessly it's done let me show you an example which i built here so this balcony here it's all blocks i'm mean, like blocked out in a way if you see all of them are different pieces see these are three different pieces so one is this piece basically without the fencings this is the one with the walls and obviously one side fence here and this is the one side of the fence and without the fence that's how i did it and as far as you might be thinking the columns are here yeah i kind of glitched it because they looked weird because inside they just don't fit right with me so i was like might as well do that and yeah oh wait this item sorry and same goes if when you're building balconies upstairs too it's the same process blocking block block just block it just once you get the hang of this feature you're gonna understand it and it's just gonna be easier for you so let me maybe remove one of the balconies and show you for example this one will be easier to demonstrate it so let me put all of that in 
hopefully I don't remove the whole room <laughs> see how many pieces I bet this is gonna cost a lot of money yeah I didn't think that through since I believe the balcony is expensive in the game let me place the window cause that dude take my window anyways since there aren't since the balcony uses exterior wallpaper or the wall thing designs there are some interior wallpaper sorry interior wallpaper i think i said exterior since the interior since the balcony uses the interior wallpaper there will be some mismatch kind of walling situation imagine there's the wall paper like this wall that's only available in the exteriors wall section but not in the interior but you might have to use the alternative it is which is this wood yeah see this wood is like the same as this one but without the bricking on, on the bottom and the slab on the top anyways that's that enough of me ranting let's get with this so back with that as i said same the all all of the walls are up basically i mean it's not up actually sorry these are this looks like the walls but these they are actually railings so the railings are up but there will be always one wall up which is the one at the back but let's toggle this wall up and look it's fixed before it used to be flashing red because it needed a wall somehow but now it's not and then you can remove this wall because we're not going to be needing it either way and then let's put it in place like that and then the same goes with this we don't need that we don't need this either and push it in i think that's how big it was yeah we don't need that place although there will be like these kind of pillars coming through and will be like odd sh length like that but gonna have to do with the things we have so can't really do anything can't really fix that but maybe the team might make this m m might expand the feature with future updates by using different shaped rooms so who knows so as i said remove the walls because uh, in my case oh see ah uh, here's the bug see this says the location is invalid and i is and it's not allowing me to place my balcony even though it's like the same thing um let me let me see let me see if it allows me now see now it does i think it's because one of the wall was up but that's that um i mean if you don't want all of the walls up you can use the apply to all sides basically it's gonna apply to all sides so it's gonna be easier for you and that's that see it fits it in sing seamlessly same goes with this let me first resize it to the side that i need and then i don't need this side either way neither that one and placed and then this one mm, maybe i'll be like i want this side to be bigger okay let's go up okay you know what i think i might need okay i need that and then see it's flashing again again the same thing build up the wall fixed and oh wait <laughs> i forgot remove this wall fixed and then same thing removed all of these stupid ass walls and you will be done oh wait you don't need to remove you just need to remove this and this and this needs to be as a balcony and a railing and here you guys slots right in and basically that's how it is that's how it's done and yeah that's it it looks so nice i'm so happy that balconies are finally in the game and then you can change your railings to the one that you desire and that's it
for that. Oh yeah. Anyway, not that's not it. This one. So basically, as I said, this um balcony, the game considers the balcony wall as an interior wall, but can't do anything. This might be fixed or figured out later on. But look, it uses the interior wallpapers and not the exterior ones. So yeah. Since luckily this wood type is same as this one but without the top bits and the bottom, you can easily fit it in and that's it. It's fitting in fitting in like nothing. And that's how it is. I mean that's how the wall is figured out. Basically, in sh I mean if I say this in short, just make this um Turn this wall toggle your, uh, into your best friend. Just make it your best friend. This wall toggle is going to be your best friend when building balconies because the wall toggle is everything in the game. Only when building the balconies, of course. And let me show you the things that you, more things that you can do. Actually, I didn't test half the things out, but because obviously half the time before we got the game, it was a bit buggy, but now it should not be oh yeah how you can see there's a big ass shadow a huge roof showing i don't know how is that caused but it never happened before i think it's because of the balconies and the stuff anyway that doesn't really bother much or affect anything i mean imagine you want to make a bridge well that's possible the possibilities are actually endless and again as i said walls up on that side doesn't matter if you want walls on any other side imagine not imagine sorry the walls walls should be up on a balcony if it's if it's gonna be if you're gonna place it against another wall basically and you can remove a wall if it's not placing again. If you're not placing it against the wall, sorry. Sorry, my my language is just I'm 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 feeling just, I'm just sleepy at this point. Cause actually it's just late night here in the UK and yeah, I'm tired. And here it is. It works perfectly fine. Even the roofing is not glitched. I like how the auto roofing works in the Sims World, I'm not gonna lie. Anyways, walls up and then that's it. And then that's how it works. And yeah, there's, there'll be some visual glitches, but that's nothing. When you go up or something, like upper floor, it's just gonna be like, oh, it's missing some places, but it's not and it's perfectly fine. I think there are some shadow glitches with the railings, with some of the railings, I believe. I think it's just our games, the test games, I believe. Once I do it, the once I download the real one, or re, not the real one, sorry, once I download the live version, it should work perfectly fine for me. The shadows, because the shadow is just glitched out. Hopefully, the sim gurus fix this shadow glitch. Which is right on the top of like look there's a huge roof that just covers out of nowhere i don't know how why is that happening and i will definitely love to learn about it though it is something completely like blows my mind oh yeah since i'm on level 58 and closer to 60 the prices of the balconies are 10,000 simoleons now that's expensive but i I think the starting price is 7,000, I believe, as far as I saw. It's still expensive, but can't do anything. Sorry. Oh, yeah. There are still shadow glitches. There's no shadow coming in anyways. But that's that. Aside from that, great balcony feature. You can do everything. You can place anything, basically. Oh, what? I think this is... The not meant to be happening <laughs> but i am not gonna complain i'm not gonna complain <laughs> you basically can place any furniture wait can you actually place a toilet out okay it does not place it 
freaking place. I mean, this shower is meant to be an outdoor shower. Okay, not allowed to play the shower. Okay, the game thinks. Okay, the game actually thinks this as an outside place, but you can place this and be like, it's your own personal private place. Anyways, you can place a lot of stuff outside like this. A bed. <laughs> I don't know why, but mm, you can place a couch too. Let me place the one that comes in the Bella's Balcony quest, which will be starting at 26th of December, I believe. And I, and it's here. And I love how it looks. And see, it fits in right well. Let's make a cozy place. And yeah, we can basically place anything outside and just relax with your Sims. Cozy up. Nice, she's liking the balconies. Finally, after years, we have balconies in the game. And yeah, oh yeah, another one. Here yeah, you see, thank god this popped up. Imagine if you're... So, as you know, way before in the video, I did place a railing on this side. But it's disappeared once I came back into this lot or locked back into my game. And these things are popping up, even though I removed all of the railings from here. Easy solution to fix it is go back in your balcony section and then toggle your walls up again. Fixed. And then same with this. Oh, wait, it's not that that's the wrong. Okay, since there are two pieces, you don't know which ones might be actually glitching. So do all of the sides. And then hit cancel it should okay that's not the one then it might be this one again toggle all of the walls up and then hit cancel on the top and it disappeared see same goes with this since you can see the one on the wall same all sides cancel it's not that one okay it's this one i bet i bet so walls up or down anything gone see it's gone so that's how you fix that issue if you get that issue and yeah i forgot to mention or show one way another way is uh, not another way it's like a way like you can use balconies as a roofing tool and you know i mean and yeah that's the imagine i have this simple box room kind of situation and i want to create like a flat balcony or flat roofs since flat roofs are not an option in the game as of yet we can still kind of give it an illusion of it by having or using balconies is that with this can use the roofing feature as that as i mentioned it previously when placing a balcony against a wall a wall should be always toggled up in the balcony or within the balcony whichever way but yeah when placing a balcony against a wall a wall should be always up in the balconies on the balcony section so yeah and at the current stage this doesn't really look like a flat roof but let's remove all of these walls we don't need these walls and basically that's a flat roof i guess you can call it a flat roof i don't know oh yeah imagine if you actually want flat roof you wouldn't be able to do one imagine if you want flat roofs everywhere including on the first which if you see on my um floor toggling options or changing options i'm on the roof now and once you're on the roof you can't really place rooms or anything on top so that's it this is the limit the limit starts here is that the roof here is going to be a roof but you can't turn into a flat roof so that other than that you can do anything with this feature basically you can um Maybe if you want to extend it upwards more. Wait. 
Imagine you want to extend it and make it look like an actual like hanging off flat roof and you can do that but you see the mistake here since this wall would be coming out or you can use that as like a cool building thing features in a way but if you don't want that happening you can still do the same thing remove all of the walls by using the all size applied and then should work should be working as a charm yep 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 it works as a charm so in short as i said before use the wall toggle mode make it your best friend and this doesn't really look like a flat roof because yeah but <laughs> better than, than nothing it yeah since it's like really flat like it does not have any volume to it so maybe one day we'll get a platform feature in the game who knows let me remove this wall don't need it oh yeah imagine did you see like how the wall was actually up here but the wall wasn't actually up it's just the glitch so you can just do the same thing as i told you or you can just do that and then that's it the flat roof in a way you can do that and yeah other than that it works and i think yeah you can't really use the animation the railings animation to it but other than that you can use it you can do anything else but make sure that your sims are safe <laughs> oh my gosh i mean they can sit down here do anything oh i did not know that you can place your furniture at the edge maybe your sim is at two risk a lot of risk floating oh my god this is really nice let's see sims relax let me call this sim up here oh they can relax really nice floating chair we need one <laughs> but yeah that's it that's it for the video and if i'm missing anything please do make sure you ask me questions if you have any questions about the balconies feature in the comment section below and even on twitter and if you want to see more videos like this like early access videos about the sims mobile please do make sure to subscribe to the channel and yeah it's my first time again it's my first time making a walkthrough of a feature so if i'm missing anything sorry but other than that everything's it this is it all you need to know about the balconies feature in the game and balconies are finally in the game yay till then take care subscribe to the channel like the video take care and dag dag <laughs>